I chose Rainbow Six Siege simply because that it was a game that was easy to get into. I came from League of Legends and it was very hard to go pro in a game that has such an established esports scene, same with a game such as Counter-Strike. So with Siege coming out, it's a newly branded, not that uh, dedicated scene, it's an easier leap into it. And everybody's an amateur, you gotta make a name for yourself. My name is Niklas Pingo Morten, and I am the longest lasting member of the current or former Penn Sports roster, current G2 Esports roster. I have been with the team for almost three years in total, two and a half years with Fabian, Goga, and Jonas. I actually just reached my 10,000 hour, uh, you know, total across those almost three years, and that is the current record for any pro player and possibly also for any casual player out there. So the current situation here with the team is that it's a family-friendly, low-key scenario. Uh, to put it into perspective, I would say Fabi and I, the, you know, the big brothers and knowing the smaller brothers, which is usually Goga and Junas. And then we have Kent or Katie, who's this weird cousin that comes over, you know, once every Christmas or, you know, every, every birthday now and again. So Kent's involvement is a little bit less, whereas Fabi and I have a lot of involvement. And that uh, involvement is crucially around Goga and Junas, trying to help them, guide them, and, and vice versa, them guiding us. Um, so we're hard on each other, but in a, in a good way. We'd like to say that we can criticize and we can also take criticism most of the time, trying to do it as neutral as possible. We have picked up three Pro League titles, one Dreamhack, Spanish Major, and more recently the River Six Siege Invitationals 2018 this earlier February. And uh, hopefully we're about to nail the Paris Major as well. That was an instant gratification at the Invitationals where a 11-year-old son and his father came up to me and, and the biggest of fans, both of them, but most importantly the fathership that they had together um, where they shared this moment where the father could share a moment with his son via me as he looked up to me as a player. That was something that I wish I could have with my father back when I was a kid and it's something that I hope that I could inspire in others.